My name is Mr. Gordon from Arima, together with the assistants. We have received some food items from different people who have donated. And we are going to give out to people who are in need from different communities all around the region of Arima. Hey, Pastor Martin. For sure, Mr. Gordon and the others. So we are going to distribute those foods for those who are in need because many people, they are in need because of the situation that we are going through. But I believe those who will receive this food donation, this food that we have here, they will be blessed by God. In Jesus Christ's name. I am here right now in Sandy Grande and we are here doing our unisocial work because this is our pleasure to help those who are in need. And I have here with me, what's your name? Miss Lenora. She told me that she is in a very bad situation. Miss Lenora, how is your situation? So, you have no rice, no food to eat. So, she has no rice, she has no food to eat. But today, she found help in our unisocial work. Look how important is our work. And if you want to join us, you are very welcome. God bless you. If you would like to help or partner with us in this relief venture, please call 389-9880 or 709-8062. Unisocial, reaching out to those in need. Unisocial Trinidad and Tobago, moving forward in the region of Princess Town. Hello, may God bless you all. We are here from Princess Town, from the Universal Church in Princess Town. We are not wasting time. As I said, I was hungry and you fed me. We are walking around. We are going to supermarkets. We are asking people for groceries, for donation, because as we know, due to the situation now, many people are hungry. And uh, give us your help as well. You can send your groceries. You can support this work because many people right now, they are in a situation of emergency. What do you think about that right now in this hard moment, in this hard time? What do you think that is important that everybody should do in order to help people they, who are less fortunate? Pastor, what I think I should do is that everybody should come together and help each other because there are a lot of people there have nothing to eat. And believe me, Pastor, when I sit down to eat, I just pray before I eat as the Lord, I am eating, but who have nothing provide for them? So in other words, you may have your needs, but you're still thinking about others. Yes, Pastor, I do. And whatever little I, from what I have and what I have received, I would like to give to others. At least they have something. And we appreciate so much and for sure God will bless you. This is it. Everybody can help some way, somehow. We would like to say thank you for joining hands with us to reach out to those who are in desperate need at this time. Because with such sacrifices, God is well pleased. Another person helped us today with a donation for us to buy the groceries in order to make the hamper should donate for the less fortunate one. I would like to appreciate, to thank you very much, and for sure, many people will be helped by this donation. Hello, we have here somebody else that kindly donates more groceries, and to appreciate very much for what you're doing. It's going to help a lot of people. And you there that you can help us, please help us. It's a time that all of us, we must come together as a family, as one team. May God bless you and thank you very much.
As a result of the rising numbers of families in need, the Unisocial Team, the Outreach and Social Work Group of the Universal Church, took to the streets of Tobago to gather items in order to create hampers for those especially struggling during the COVID-19 pandemic. Ms. Curlin, what do you think about this special work we are doing this evening? Well, I think it's a very good thing because there's a lot of people who are out of work, don't know where the next bread coming from, they have children, they don't know where the food coming from, so I think this is a little help at least to keep them one day at a time until things get better. We are here with the goods, with the members and the community of Glen Road. The people in the community donated goods from their homes to help support those who don't have and if you are willing to support us to support those who don't have you can contact any of the assistants that are here the pastor is here from 7 a.m to 5 30 p.m daily please call 389-9880 or 709-8062 hello everyone here i am in our church in tobago as you can see today we have a very good work people this morning they sent something, they brought something to the church for us to prepare a hampers. We went there in a village, people, they gave something for us to help those who are in need. So thank for your support and believe because you gave, God he will give you more, much, much more. Not will lack for you. May the Lord bless you all. Unisocial, reaching out to those in need. As a result of the rising numbers of families in need, the Unisocial Team, the Outreach and Social Work Group of the Universal Church, took to the streets of Tunapuna and Environs to gather items in order to create hampers for those especially struggling during the COVID-19 pandemic. If you would like to help, or partner with us in this relief venture, please call 389-9880 or 709-8062. We are here from the Universal Church doing the social work in the Tunapuna area collecting food items. People are donating food items where we are going to donate to people food items. We are going to the grocery and we are going to purchase food items to contribute to these people who are in need around this time. So we are thanking you on behalf of the Universal Church, everyone who contributed during this time and for this cause. Unisocial reaching out to those in need. Unisocial Trinidad and Tobago. Here we are in 2014. We are doing the food drive and we're going to bless the life of the need. And today we're going to fill this basket. And for sure, we're going to help many broken homes. The Universal Church in moving towards our target of helping the less fortunate in society has risen to the occasion with our special food drive in the region of San Fernando. Here we are from the Universal Church in Point 14. We are doing a special work of Unisocial and we thank you very much for the sponsors. And as you take from your table, you take from a table to give to someone else's table. As you give from your table today, God is going to make sure your table prosper tomorrow. May God bless you. 
by going out to seek for the nations with the aim and objective to rescue the needy and bring hope to those who are longing for a daily meal to provide for their families. It is written, He who gives to the poor will not lack. My dear friend, we are here in this community to help Uomo family. Everything is locked down as you can see, but the work of the Universal Church of the Kingdom of God does not stop. We are here to help this family physically, as you can see, but also spiritually. Mi Dios y mi Padre, en nombre de Jesús, te damos gracias, mi Dios, por todo eso que el Señor venga a bendecir, venga a quitar, mi Dios, ese espíritu, ese virus, mi Dios, de nuestra ciudad, de nuestro país, de nuestro mundo, mi Dios, y venga a bendecir todas las familias, mi Dios, mi Dios, las, la gente que está necesitada ahora, mi Dios, el alimento, que el Señor venga a traer la provisión y venga a derramar tus bendiciones, envía tus ángeles, mi Dios, para guardar y proteger nuestras familias, en el nombre de Jesús, amén. And today we are here in another community, though we are here in a lockdown, but the work of the universal church does not stop. We are here once again to have another run. Both physically and spiritually. We also we are going to say a special prayer on their behalf so that God may bless their life. And in the same way that we are helping them, you also you can help. This is the work of the universal church, the new social, and you also you can help us to help someone. We God bless you all. It's very simple to watch the Living Faith Network online. Visit watch.ulfn.org. On the page, click on the register option and fill out the on-screen form. You will also be required to confirm your account by email. Next, return to the watch.ulfn.org page. Once you are there, click on the option 24-hour stream. And there you go. Invest in your faith daily with live programs and testimonies that will prove to you that faith in action brings real results. Register today for free. Stay connected as these people are doing. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel, Universal Church Trinidad and Tobago, and receive the links for our live services every day. Hit the notification bell, like and subscribe to follow us on our YouTube channel and Facebook page. So friends, once more again, here we are on the altar. I have my water, Pastor Junior. I see your water over there. Every night every night every day in our services today we have blessed this water in our services we told people to prepare a bottle 
they should prepare their bottles since last Sunday. We don't really know exactly the day the lockdown is going to end. We don't know exactly yet, but yet we already begun to bless this water because this will be like a new water for us. David, he desired to come into the sanctuary of God. And he said he was in a dry land. In other words, a land of problems. A land of situations. So many people here in this land, we know Trinidad is a very prosperous land, a very blessed country. Yet, so many people, they have problems, they have situations that they face, and they want to overcome it. And we do believe that when we drink of this water, on the day appointed, on the day appointed, we don't know exactly the day yet, However, when people, they will be able to come pass on the altar, they will drink of the new water. And I do believe that all those problems, that dryness that they have is going to be removed. Financial problems, sicknesses, diseases, uh, uh, people who are desperate, people who are in need of a way out. They will see this way out. Definite, Pastor. And as you said, Trinidad is a very prosperous land. But the numbers of divorce have been increased every single day. The numbers of domestic violence as well have been increased every single day. It means that there are many families that they have been destroyed. Couples, they get divorced. Many people, they have a lot of life problems as well. And this water is going to quench their thirst in their love life and help their family to be united, to be blessed as well. So, friend, those of you who want your family to be united or reunited, it's good for you to have your water. Prepare it. Prepare it. Prepare this bottle because we are going to send this blessing for you now. Your family will be blessed. Your family, God, will bring them back together. And we do believe that wherever you are, you could be alone by yourself, but the Spirit of God is going to be there with you as we know he's here with us go ahead bless our water please yes close your eyes our lord and our father in the name of your son jesus god we are here right now on your altar and we ask you father for you to consecrate and bless this water because lord when we have the reopening of the temple and when this person they use they drink of this water great things will take place in their lives the same way lord that one day you change water into wine you did a great transformation in the past the same thing will take place here in the house of this woman the son that is addicted to drugs the husband that left the house this couple that they keep in fighting every single day ah my lord when they drink from this water a great change will take place in this family in the life of this person ah my lord this house that is a place of fighting is going to be a place of joy yes it's going to be a peace of heaven here here on earth, my Lord, I ask you for you to visit this person, whatever they are, this water that they have in their hands by faith, Lord, is already their victory in their hands. And when we use this water, great things will take place in this person's life. And also, Lord, I ask you for you to bless Trinidad and Tobago. Oh, my Father, protect us. Do not allow this, the numbers of people that they have been affected by this coronavirus to increase here. No, Father, by faith here, we are served on the altar. We stop this plague. Yes, we fight right now against all kind of evil that's working here in Trinidad and Tobago. My Lord, I pray on behalf of our Prime Minister. Give, my Lord, to him your wisdom, your knowledge. My Lord, I pray on behalf of all the ministers, help them, protect them, guide them, bless the nurses.
nurses, lords at the hospital. Bless the doctors, the firefighters. My Lord, bless the police officers. Each one of them that they have been helping Trinidad and Tobago to move forward. Trinidad and Tobago, from the altar, we bless you. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And whoever believes that where you are, say amen. Amen. Praise God. So my friend, tomorrow we are going to be together in the therapy of love. 8.30 in the morning in the Beyond Limits program. Also at the hour of miracle at 1 and especially 5 p.m. when we are going to have the therapy of love in the strong nation. Exactly, Pastor. And also we are going to be praying and consecrate the water because I believe that God is going to do great things in their lives. Be, be prepared for tomorrow, 5 p.m. That's going to be our special service that's going to bless your love life. Family that prays together, stay together. Together. And talking about family, we are family. We have to think on the next, we have to think on our neighbor. So think on someone besides you. Think on somebody that does not have the same condition that you do. That's the reason why we are asking for your contribution with our unisocial program. We have been helping a lot of people. Many people have been helped through the Unisocial. And you can join faith, strength together with us. Regardless your religion's background, you can help with non-perishable items, with water, baby food, uh, toiletries as well. You can send or you can call us to come to pick it up. Or you can pass by at any universal church countrywide and you can drop this help because my friend someone in need will be receiving those donations and we have the assurance that as God has blessed you God is going to bless that person with those items as well you are going to watch now uh, the work of the unisocial and how we have been sharing those hampers and besides that friend do not forget don't forget as God has provided to you, help us to provide to someone else. Have yourself a very blessed night. See you. Due to the tremendous success of our Unisocial Week in Trinidad and Tobago, giving back to the communities, And by touching the lives of many, the Universal Church to continue with reaching the hundreds of homes who have been stricken with this nightmare of COVID-19, we come to you by asking your donations of these non-perishable items. Water, canned foods, cleaning products, and any other help will be greatly welcome. You can drop off these items to any of our branches nationwide. If you have these non-perishable items, cases of water, and clean products in large quantities to donate, you can arrange to pick up with one of our drivers by calling any one of these numbers. 389-9880 or 709-8062. Perhaps with all the situation the world is facing nowadays, you feel lonely, frustrated, and have no one to talk to. Perhaps you're under quarantine and isolated from loved ones, and going to church and speaking to a pastor face-to-face -face is no longer an option. Thinking about you, the Universal Church created the online pastor live chat. 24 hours a day, pastors are on standby to listen to you, give a word of faith, and pray for you and your family. Completely free and confidential. To access this service, visit ulfn.org slash online pastor. When you click on the specific problem or the speak to a pastor button, 
a dialog box will pop up. Fill in your information. Agree to the terms and begin chatting immediately. You have three options, text, voice, and video. Need to speak to a pastor today? Just visit ulfn.org slash online pastor. Available 24 hours a day, seven days a week, free to all.